So first of all, um, I want to ask you, clearly it's an adaptation in between, I guess there was an adaptation for theater, but I want to ask you, uh, which was the element for you that has not to be missing in the TV adaptation just to keep the core and the soul of your book intact? What meant the most to me in terms of that? Yeah. Um, it was, it was the, the grief, the mother loss at the center of the story. I said to, to Liz Tigalar, the showrunner, when we first started talking about adapting it, that I understood that adaptation should yeah. take us into all kinds of fictional realms. The character that Catherine Hahn plays is not me. It's very fictional. There are elements of me, but, you know, she's a character of our creation. But what I said is she has to have shared the formative experiences. For, foremost being, she has to have, a, have lost her mother because, of course, that being the greatest loss of my life has also been the greatest teacher of my life and so we began from that premise she also had to share other things you know an estranged father growing up poor yeah. and having to struggle her way and so we put into that backstory the the, the younger claire that sarah pigeon plays those things that are very much um part of me and we knew that those things were very important to have in the story Yeah. Can I tell you, I relate so much to this story and I guess for me at least it's really needed because it tells a story of women not so young, not so young anymore, just like me, but I guess it's important to say nowadays that women can have still to struggle, you know, to cure themselves and to heal. So I want to ask you how much is important for you. Obviously, you're speaking, you're talking about yourself, but how much is important to tell the story for other women, you know, to, to read the story like this? Absolutely. And I think one of the pieces of advice that I write over and over again in my work as Sugar is that we are constantly evolving that I think so many people think like, okay, in your 20s is when you're confused and yeah. you figure out where who you are and you go through those rites of passage and then, and then you're fine. But what we know is that's not true. We know that at every transition, uh, some, some of them are hard transitions, the death of a loved one, a breakup of a relationship. Yeah. Some are beautiful. You have a baby, you get married, you get a new job or you know other transitions like menopause you know i'm 54 years old moving into that next yeah, of course. life those are all opportunities to grow and evolve to expand to become wiser to become kinder become better and i think that so much of what i tried to convey um in talking to the writers about this character of claire that it's not that she's some messed up woman who is just lost she's actually got a lot of wisdom but she also has things to still figure out like we all do yeah, yeah i agree one last easy question uh were you surprised i mean by sh the tv show there is something that kind of surprised you too watching it well the whole thing surprises me <laughs> even <laughs> though i was a very much a big part of this i was in the writer's room i'm an executive producer i've been in conversations about this show for years I must say, the first time I watched the pilot, all I could think is, how could this be real or true? I mean, how could this have happened in my life? I came from such truly humble beginnings. I so wish my mother were here to see this day.